Many Samsung device owners encounter freezing or crashing issues over the course of their usage. While not that common, this type of issue is still pretty significant considering the millions of Samsung devices in circulation around the world. If your Samsung keeps freezing and you have no idea how to fix it, follow the solutions we provide in this video. If a Samsung device is freezing all the time, it can be caused by a simple bug in one of the apps or it may be something deeper within the software. Some freezing issues are easily fixed by doing a simple task. Installing an update. There are two types of updates that you will encounter in Android. App updates and software updates. You will normally receive notifications if there are pending updates, so all you have to do is to tap on the notification and proceed with the update. Some poorly built apps may not work properly in some Samsung devices and cause problems. If your Samsung phone or tablet started crashing or freezing after installing an app, you can use a diagnostic tool called Safe Mode to check. When on Safe Mode, all third-party apps are grayed out and blocked from running by the systems. This means that only the pre-installed apps that came with the software can be opened. If your Samsung runs normally without crashing or freezing on Safe Mode, you can assume that one of the third-party apps is behind the trouble. Some Samsung phones and tablets suffer annoying crashes after an update. This is not new and this phenomenon has been observed over the years. This does not necessarily mean that Android updates are directly the cause of the problem, as there are a myriad of other factors to consider. But since it's difficult to identify the cause of the problem by focusing on one factor only, there's no really too easy way to pinpoint the true reason for any given freezing or crashing problem. One of the common reasons for freezing issues right after an update though, is a bad system cache. This cache is a set of temporary files often used by Android operating system. To ensure that the system cache is in top shape, make sure to clear the cache partition. In some cases, a memory glitch related to app functions may be to blame. If it appears that the device crashes only when trying to use or load a particular app, make sure to optimize your device by clearing app cache and data. If nothing has worked at this point, you should consider performing a factory reset on your device. This is the most effective way to fix a lot of software issues in Android devices, so if the cause of the problem is due to a software glitch, wiping your phone or tablet and returning its settings to defaults will most likely work. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more videos in the future. Thanks for watching.